Welcome back, everyone. It's the Aces NFL Best Bets Week 8. That's right. We are up to week 8 already at the NFL, and we're ready to cook up our best last week. few injuries, so we won't talk about them. But this week, there's some great games. Last week was tough. This week, it shouldn't be that hard at all. We have some massive games. And uh, as you know, Sip is on holidays, but the show goes on, and I'm going to read out his best bets. But I'll start with mine, and then I'll read out Sip's at the end. Tyreek Hill over 83.5 yards receiving. He is ready to explode. He's got his quarterback back in town. He gets a great matchup, and he is going to really make you happy this week. So 83 and a half, you can tease it. You can do what you want. I'm going to keep it simple, but you get your $1.85 and run there. Tyreek Hill will be exploding, and uh, I'm really looking forward to seeing the Miami Dolphins back uh, on track with their offense with Tua under center, and they go up against a pretty easy defense. I'll keep moving into the props. Jameis Winston is the quarterback of the Cleveland Browns now. They're playing my boys, the Ravens. The Ravens are a pass funnel. They allow you to get a lot of cheap yards. They do not let you run the ball. So Jameis, he's been known to sling that thing, and he's got some good receivers still. I think Njoku's a great tight end. Jerry Judy, Elijah Moore, they've got great players, and I think he can pass the ball. For 225 passing yards at $1.80, take it and run. Now let's go to one more prop. And this is a guy that, remember I said in the podcast earlier, that Patrick Mahomes, they took the piss out of this guy, the Raiders. Can you believe that? The Raiders players were impersonating him as a frog and taking the piss out of him preseason, all right? So two passing touchdowns against the Raiders. He might even go for five, like Lamar did last week. But let's keep it simple. Two touchdowns, $1.83. He'll be passing them. I wouldn't be surprised if Kelsey gets one, but that's not what I'm telling you. It's Mahomes, two passing touchdowns this week at $1.83. And my anytime touchdown scorer, it's going to be Devontae Adams against the Patriots. They'll be up there a bit. The Jags went wild last week, and I expect the same. You've got to remember that Hassan Reddick is back in town, so I think Aaron Rodgers might be in the red zone a lot. And Devontae Adams, he's been paid a lot of money. There's been a lot of talk. Aaron Rodgers' best friend. I think there'll be a few plays drawn up uh, for the great man. So get that in there. You multi them all up. You get 15 bucks. Gamble responsibly, obviously. Check out the sports bet feed. Check out my profile. There's also an Oz American Aces profile. Follow them. Get around them and let's win together and make sure we uh, party together as well. Now, let's go to Sips Bets. He's just sent me his ones through yesterday. We'll go through his, but he likes Kirk Cousins, 250 passing yards. It's a great bet in my opinion as well. They're going up against the Bucks. and that secondary, I think Lamar just went for 280 and five touchdowns and got rested. So... Great little uh, prop from Sip. He then moves on to A-Chain, 70-plus scrimmage yards for the Dolphins. We know that A-Chain gets going, and when Tyreek Hill gets going, so does A-Chain, so love that one. Javante Williams, anytime TD for the Broncos. They get a soft matchup this week. He had two last week. They're going to run the ball. Uh, That should be saluting for sure. And, of course, the Sip couldn't leave out Saquon Barkley, anytime touchdown scorer, There you go. They are our best bets for week eight. Follow them on the feed. Check it out. We'll put them up individually. We'll put them up separately. We'll do a touchdown. We'll do a prop. Get around them. Let's hope we can go eight from eight, and we'll see you next week, and we'll be partying together. Hope you all get a win in fantasy. Hope you all get a little collect, and thank you for tuning in.